Hello guys and girls and welcome back to City Skyline modded with me Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me. Here we are in Sippity City and our little park here that got completely destroyed by fire in the last episode is perfectly restored. It's good. Everything eventually grows back. Everything is looking nice which I'm really glad about. And look it's like the Subaru Meters Club today. They will come in over here. They've got their Subarus. There we go, Subaru. Lovely, lovely. They're all coming over here to enjoy enjoy the lovely park together. Well, that's fair enough. You can do that if you so wish. So, what are we going to be working on today? Well, I did a little bit of work on something over here just off camera while I was watching somebody do some streaming. Let me show you that first. There we go. So we've expanded out this area over here. I bought another square, this one down here, just so I could expand out a little bit. I want to just sort of finish off this section. I'm excited to do something over here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. Look at these vineyards. I like these vineyards up in the hills. That is really, really cool. Uh, and this is calling out for another... Let's have a look. They're not motorway roads. They're like national roads, aren't they, that are going through there. I can't select them. Um, so we've got the main motorway, like a little national road that can come off through there. And maybe sort of dip under here to... Oh, a building has leveled up. Well, thank you very much. That's, that's cool to know. Thank you. I don't know which building that was, but <laughs> that's nice. Let's take care of a couple of quick needs, first of all. Oh, these are all full up. Let's empty... Let's empty our dumpsters, otherwise we are going to have a trash problem. Just off camera, uh, I put in a incineration plant. So he's working hard. He's only got one truck in use. So I'm hoping he keeps himself busy. But anywho, uh, I've slightly changed the farming zone over here. So we have a bit more farming going on. Thank you for all the telling me about the new buildings. We could expand some of that. Wow, that was a lot. Let's do that up there. Does the farming zone cover there? It does. So let's get some more farming industry in. That works well at the moment because, as you can see, 99.999, in fact, 100% of our residential at the moment is low-density residential. All the way over here to the British Isles, the British Island. Um, yes, yeah, so we don't want to overload that. Do you know what I'm just thinking, actually? One of these... One of these little dumpster areas, because they've got to travel all the way across up here. We could put one up here, couldn't we? Thank you very much for telling me about new stuff. Yep, 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 yep. New buildings, thank you. What are these? Glass stuff. Okay, I want to find dumpster. Garbage, dumpster area. We could just put one of those on this island. Sort of tucked away somewhere. Let's run. Yeah, we've upgraded. We've got all these new buildings it keeps telling me about. I know, I know. Two-lane gravel road. Let's add one. 
just coming down there. And let's add that little dumpster just there. I'm hoping that that isn't going to cause any problems with noise and whatnot. So how are these ones? Uh, where are they? Where are they? They're here. Well, this is all noisy anyway. What's the pollution like? Hmm. We'll see how that goes. We'll put that in there. Just like a little dumpster on the island. Yeah, they're already out with their trucks. And see how that goes. Uh, we've added in as well, before we get building our next section. Yes, thank you. More new buildings. Uh, we've added in some names over here for some of our areas. Thank you very much to those of you that suggested the names. Oolongshire Park. So, Oolongshire from Funky Teaspoon. Great name for this new little area. We have Darjeeling Downs, which is this area here. That was suggested by Havoc10. Thank you for that suggestion. Uh, suggestion. Uh, this area over here, Tea Mountain Bay. I like that. Of course, we have the mountains at the back there. And it's sort of... It's not a bay, is it? But, yeah, it's by the water. So, we went with that one anyway. Tea Mountain Bay. That was by George LP. Thank you very much. Brewville. I like that name, and I think that suited this new area that we built last time. Uh, Roaming Curious suggested Brewville. So we've got Brewville Heights, but we need to get some more commercial stuff going. So I was thinking we could do something with this area over here. Um, I would like to add some more parking. In. We've got all these sort of different parking things that, can, that we can add in. Thank you. 4x10. Oh man, that is massive. Look at that. But we need to do some sort of parking thing. Wow, 10x4. What's the biggest? That's probably, isn't it? I know, the new buildings! 5x8. Nice. Anyway, we need to add some parking. There's this road parking, which is quite cool. If we put some of that along the side here. And it's got like a little wall along the back. So... Could you add those this way? No, you can't. What about... Oh, it sort of overlaps. How does that work? Yeah, it doesn't like that, does it? No, it doesn't like that. Well, that's fine. Oh, small city. Oh, we got cable cars and monorail. Oh, we're probably going to have to do something with that today. Loads of cool stuff coming in. Oh, I like the look of that station. That's nice. Excellent. The next one's 12,000. Cool. Let's just move this along. So if I attach that to there. Give that a little tweak. Yeah, so we could do something with that parking. I'm just wondering now whether we could get our monorail going. Hmm. Because at the minute we've got... We've got this guy running up and down here, our trams. It was suggested to make the trams go into the park. I have two stops. Uh, let's turn that off. Here and here, so they can get over to here easily. But I'm wondering whether... Why are you complaining about the tax? Tax is too high. Really? Now, that's interesting, because I've got them on 13%. Let's drop them to 12. Normally... 13% is perfectly fine. But maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, I'm worried about our trash becoming a problem. Incineration status is, is not enough. Uh, we are... Oh, I bet I know what it is. Is he not sending out trucks? They're not. It's that weird one-way road thing again, isn't it? You're going to come over here. So these are going to go up, go round, come over here. There we go. The trucks are going out. Darn it. It looks like we need a couple to really get a handle on this problem. Uh, let's put another one here. And then we'll, we will work on this area at some point. Quick sip of tea. Yeah. That's going to make that junction very busy. So it might be an idea. I might just move him somewhere else. Let's pop him down the end over here. And if... In fact, shall I do the same with him? I'm going to run this road through here. Yes, thank you for the new uh, building. Let's run our four-lane road down to there. And then we're going to move that guy down to here. He should work fine. Hopefully. 
Whoa, they're all turning round. Hmm. I'm worried. I'm worried that they're not sending out trucks. He's sending out trucks. Anywho. Let's just plop that out there. Four of 27. Yeah, they're working. And that's on the right side of the road for these to come out and go straight in. Perfect. Right, we'll let that carry on. That will sort itself out. We need... I'm thinking a nice big... Seafront commercial area over here. I think that would be absolutely fantastic. We've got, like, the roads and stuff in to help us to get to that. Um, let's see. Let's see if we can extend this a little bit. In a way that's natural and makes sense. So that came along here. Hmm. Now that's an interesting junction, isn't it? We could actually keep that like that, because this isn't going anywhere. This was not going to go over to here. Could I add a bridge? Let's see if we can change this end section. I'm wondering whether we could get a monorail going down here. And running down into our industrial area. Down this street. Up there, along there, up to here. And then we have our trams that come along here. And people can switch over. Oh, can I get a monorail to a tram going across there? I bet I can't. I bet that's not going to let me do that. Uh, where's the monorail? Trains, ships, planes, automobiles. Monorail. Stop. Okay, look. I'm looking through all the new buildings. There we go. I've looked at them all. Thank you very much. Please don't tell me about them anymore. Right. So if I, for instance, upgraded that and that. Uh, space already occupied. I want to know whether that's going to connect those two. I know what that is. It's my helicopters. Let's... <laughs> We're going to end up moving these like three times. Let's put them over there. Oh, it does. Look, the trams go underneath the monorails. That is perfect. What's that? Is it this here that it's not letting me play? Oh, these are going to go anyway. These are just a bit of playing around. Yep. Yep. Ah, oh, excellent. Yep, we can extend this. Get some monorail action going on. How far should we go? If it went up to there... Let's go down here. I'm wondering whether we could have it circle into this section here. What I'm thinking is, is we we do need at some point a hub where all of our transport can come together and to take people to different places. I'm just wondering whether this would be a cool place for a transport hub. I'm I'm thinking here we can use where is it? Where is it? One of these multi-platform train station? No, not one of those. Metro monorail train. Or this one. What's this one? Monorail bus hub. But I want to get the trains in here as well. Where do our train lines come in? Here. We've got a train line that comes in. Can you get off the screen? Thank you very much. Train line that comes in down here. From the outside. <laughs> new building. Yes, thank you. Let's look at all these then. Let's look at all the new buildings. Yes, thank you very much. We could run that along there and into here. And then we could have this as our hub. Okay, I'm looking through what we've got here. I'm thinking the multi-platform end station would be great to go in here somehow. And then alongside that, this new building thing's driving me insane. It's like, yes, I've seen all the buildings. And then alongside that, we are going to put in, I think this one, the monorail bus hub. We don't have metro yet. We're unlikely to have metro in this area. Uh, we'll have that in a built-up area that we put in. So I'm thinking this one in here as well would work very well. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a little play around in here and see what I come up with. Um, I think this road here is going to come out up here. Let's add all of this on. And then we're going to add the station into here somewhere. Let's go... If I go there... 
It's like something has reset in the game and it's having to tell me everything again from scratch. I bet there's a way to turn all that off, isn't there? There is. I've turned it off. Show in in game guide pop ups. Hopefully that's it now. It's gone. Um, let's add in. I want to get it straight level with this one. So let's see. How can I do that? If I grab two lane gravel roads. Come down there, go like that, go like that. I'll delete that. Darn, too close. Need to go out a little bit further. Let's try that again. I want to get it as close as possible. Yes, there we go. Nice. I want that to hook into that. I don't think that's going to go all the way. Let's go... Whoops. Let's go to that one there. See how that one goes. And then we can add to the back of this, the end point, this one here, multi-platform end station. Now, this will be interesting because we've got to get rail lines in and out of here. Let's pop it in and see. Oh, I thought it placed two there by mistake. Good. So that's going to change from here to here. And, and then we're also going to add this in, the monorail bus hub. I think that needs to connect up there. So if we get... Let's put that back on again. If we get this one here... No, let's bring it across here and see whether that attaches to there. It does. So how do they look next to each other? That is not bad at all. And then we can have people switch from that to this. They get on the trains. And then what I'm thinking is, is those trains will take people. And we've got so much more space on the rest of the map. They will take them everywhere else. But from here, they get in the tram. Uh, the tram will come in here as well and stop. We'll add a tram stop in. In fact, that will probably come. Where could I do that? Because I want tram road in here as well. And they can switch from this to the bus, to the train, to everything. Let me have, let me have a little play around with this. Okay, just sort of been playing around with this area here to see what I can do. This this fits in okay, the train station. We can have our lines go underneath and then we can move those round wherever we need them to go. I found this on the workshop. It's a monorail to tram station. I mean, that means we're not going to have our nice bus hub that's in here. Um, unless we connect it to the end somehow. I'm not sure I could fit both in. Um, but this could work well. I just wanted to see how that would connect up. Um, I mean, that's only going to come in and out, isn't it? Can that connect onto here? No, I wanted both of those to connect there. Mm, anyway, I could have a play around with that. It may be. Let's have a look. If we go out like that, can we sort of cross these over? Well, that... No. Why is that saying space already occupied? <laughs> space already occupied. I want to build off that rail. Oh, I can't go at an angle with that one. Can I go further down then do it? Yeah, if I do that... No. I was wondering if there's some way of getting those to cross. But anyway, I mean, we know we can come straight down to here. Oh, we should be able to. That one will, but this one won't. Will that one go there? Oh, man, monorails are a bit... Porky porky. I'll work that out anyway. And then we can have our tram. We can have our tram turn around. Uh, our tram line is over here. It might mean that we just remove this monorail from around this side. Because it's going to be coming up here, in and out there and going. So I don't think we're going to need this one down here either. And then our tram. Let's just see. Uh, tram line. What tram lines are we connecting onto here? Just basic tram tracks? I think so. Let's turn this off. Right, this is what we're at so far. So the trams come in this way, which hooks up really well. Um, they can turn around at the back if they need to. That's fine. The monorail, we've got that going out this way round and this way round. That's the only way we can connect it up. It won't connect straight down here, if that, even if that's monorail, which is really weird. Um, what I do want to try, though, is let's just remove that. I want to see if I can get in here as well, the bus station, and the monorail running around the back. This could be interesting. Let's see if we can just line that up like that. Um, and then if we get our monorail. Can I squeeze that in there? I can. Oh, no, I can't. 
Uh, if I turn all of this off, I bet I can. Let's see what we can do. Oh, just, just, just. Although that's going to hook up ever so winky wonky. But can I drag the end of this down to straighten it out like that? I can go to there and that looks fine. And then we can connect this up down here. So let's delete that. Let's connect straight down. So I want these back on again. Straight down. There we go. Oh, that's not a 90 degree angle, is it? Because it doesn't go both ways. Will the Move It mod help with that? Let's see. Nope. It's moving stuff, but nothing's happening. Uh, I'll tell you what we'll do then. Is we'll delete that. We'll go this way. So as long as we go 90 degrees there, we'll get the connection. Yeah, there we go. It's so ever so slightly off, you can't quite tell. I feel like I need to just move one of these down a bit. I do like the Move It mod, but you can sort of spend so long fiddling with things. I think that's it, isn't it? That is it. That is about as near as we're going to get to join up with that. So now, in this area, we have buses in here. Uh, we'll put some paths in so they can get through to the trains in here. They can then cross to the monorail in here and also the trams as well will come in. That is absolutely flipping amazing. I'm excited about that. Uh, let's get some paths through here. We're going to need some. Will they go up and underneath? If I go to there. Oh, that's just not quite near enough to join up with this. That's annoying. Are they going to walk through here? If I sort of like put a path in like that. That almost joins it together. What I have got, which I think will help. Is, let's have a look down here. Surface tool. We can paint in pavements. Uh, we can do single paint. Let's see how this is going to work. I, ha I haven't done this before. Uh, strength one. Single... Oh man, let's, if I do that too big. Oh, actually, that paints that in nicely. Let's make that a little bit smaller. Oh, that is about the size as it's going to be. So we can fill all that in to be pavement. Hmm, that's a bit weird the way it does that. Let's connect that up there. Can I, like, take that out with a right click? Oh man, that's a bit, that's a bit weird, isn't it? There's my path. Oh, it won't let me overlap the path. Okay, that's fine. As long as I go up to the path. <laughs> oh man, I could fiddle with this for hours. Okay, so I've just removed all the trees. We can work on what this look, looks like. What I'd like to try and do is get an outside train connection. We've got this one here uh, that's coming from the outside. Uh, where does that come in? It goes underneath there. Is it down in the middle of this road? Yeah, there we go. Down in the middle of that road. And it comes through down here. Can I get that to connect up? Let's see what we can do. Do I need that power connector going across there? Because that may be in the way. I sort of do, but I might have to replace it. Let's see if we can run a train line down the middle here. I'd be surprised if I could. Even if I turn all of these off. Um, yeah, it's just not going to let me place it in there. I've got all of these off. Okay, so we might need to go. I don't want to just go underground for the sake of it, but if we come, let's see, where are we going to connect this to? This outside one here. I'm thinking about trying to get it to come up the coast. And then down here, and then underneath to connect to that. I think that would probably work with... Little disruption as possible. So let's see what we can do. Uh, we've got the rail. Can you go underground for me? That would be nice. There we go. That's what we need. So let's put all these back on again. Let's go straight across. And up. This is going to be hard to get a, a, a corner going on here, isn't it? Hmm. Let's see. It's going to be like the slowest corner. 
known to man, I didn't necessarily want to go out over the water. Well, I'll tell you what we can do. We can do a little bit of ground terraforming. Okay, so I want this the same height. Let's right click there. And just sort of build this out a little bit. I don't want to go too much. Let's see what we do there. I mean, what I could do is put the rail in. It's sort of going to end up being a... Something like that. And then that's going to head off down there. That is alright, actually. That's not too bad. It's a slow... A slow slope to come in. But that's fine with me. And then if we use this one... Let's see, we can sort of loop this around here a bit. And then we want to come down over here, don't we? <laughs> so let's see if we can get a rail line in here without it jumping and connecting to everything. Go on, you can do it. You can do it, game. Actually, if I do... Where is it going to let me put it in? There. Then I can delete a bit of that. Perfect. So if we go down... Yep. Um, go underneath. This is going to be tough. There we go. That works. So it's nice and curvy underground, and then that will connect from there. Slope too steep. Okay, let's delete some of that. Why will that not connect? Can I just not connect a railway line to that? That is weird. Why won't it let me do that? That is very strange. Oh, there we go. We got it. Little bit of finagling later. We moved it around. Yes, that comes around there. Loops under there. Comes over this way, which again is going to be underground. Let's delete. We want to go under, under this guy here. Let's go for the straight one. Let's go underground. Straight out the other side and then up again. Yep, that suits me. And then we've just got to get it connected to this. Um, I mean, that could stay underground all the way. What if we get it over here somewhere? Can we do that? If we could, that would be great. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, you could keep it underground all the time. But I'm actually quite glad to have it come above the ground sometimes, just so we can see it. You know, it's cool to be able to see your train stations. Uh, your train lines, I mean, your train's going past. Yeah, that's going to come out here. That's going to do the same thing, I think. We're going to go there. We're going to go page up and make that curl itself around a little bit. Yeah, you know what? I changed my mind. It just goes down there and straight up over here. Um, this, I want to just drop down a tiny bit. Because you've got this weird sort of bridging thing going on over here. Let's drop down the point there. Not quite sure why it's doing that. It's like a dip in the ground. Oh, we'll leave it like that. A little bit of interest. Why not? Yeah, there we go. So that's going to bring in outside train connections from, for when we get uh, much more of the uh, commercial stuff set up, which we're sort of working on. This here, I'm thinking of removing all of this, this industry. This is going to be more of a commercial hub. Um, I know we need industry, but you are all going to go... There we go. Off you go. And you're going to come in over here instead. There we go. Let's add that in. Get some more farm buildings and things going. Uh, this is going to need a lot of work. This side here. Because I've been dumping. You can probably see. I've dumped a few things in. <laughs> just so we can get them working here.
Well, there we go. That is a good start to our transportation hub that we've got there. We've got our rails ready to go out this way. I've just placed a few trees and things around and some paths so people can get from uh, this side over to the other side if they so wish. And also into the lovely park that we started to set up here last time. So, any ideas of what you'd like to see in here, let me know. Uh, we'll probably come back to this in a couple of episodes and start detailing that. But we really need to expand and we also need to deal with this. Uh, pollution. I'm going to put all of this sort of stuff in its own area out of the way from the lovely farm district. But everything is looking lovely. Everything is expanding great. We've got this space over here as well. What I do need is a name for this area. T-related, transport-related district. Let me know in the comments below and I will pick that ready for the next time we come back to this area. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed, please hit the B with a tea stain up in the corner there to subscribe and be back for the next episode of City Skylines tomorrow. A like is always appreciated as well. And I will see you then. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.